the child she was carrying would have severe birth defects, she and her husband decided to terminate the pregnancy, but she had to go to Texas. I ended up having to go 350 miles away to have my abortion because I couldn't get a provider to do it in New Orleans. The ruling struck down a Louisiana law that would have made that even harder, requiring abortion doctors to have admitting privileges at a nearby hospital. Chief Justice John Roberts joined the court's four more liberal members in the 5-4 to four decision. He said the law was identical to one from Texas that the court struck down four years ago. Even though he dissented in the Texas case, he said that it is binding precedent so Louisiana's law cannot stand. President Trump's two nominees, Neil Gorsuch and Brett Kavanaugh, were among the dissenters. Clarence Thomas said the court's abortion precedents are grievously wrong and should be overturned. Kavanaugh didn't go that far and said the court should have sent the case back to gather more facts on how the Louisiana law would work. The ruling is a big win for advocates of abortion rights, but because Roberts joined only grudgingly, it leaves the door open for more restrictions. Going into an election year, this is not something that he wanted his court to preside over. He did not want to be the one um, on record as eviscerating some kind of abortion right. And thanks to Pete Williams for that report. NBC